Hey DIYers, Dylan here with Alarm Grid. Today we're going over adding hardware zones to your Simon XT panel. Uh, so the Simon XT can hold up to 40 zones in total uh, by itself with no added attachments or anything like that. The panel itself can hold two wired zones. So the 40 zones that are there, if you use two wired zones, that gives you 38 zones for wireless. Uh, if you don't use the wired zones within the panel itself, all 40 of those zones can be used for wireless by itself. Uh, there's not really an option or a, a choice that you have to make on if you want to have those two zones be not used at all or be used by wired, you can still use them for wireless. So as you can see, this is where you actually add the hardwire zones. So you'll have these terminals right here. This one is the hardwire one. It's a positive for zone one. You have a shared ground between the two and then a hardware zone two, which is the positive for zone two. Uh, this is where you actually add the wired zones itself. And then just to reiterate, you do not have to use these and then you can still use all 40 zones within the panel. So there's no resistor needed when you use the wiring on there. Uh, you just connect the, the actual sensors directly to the system itself, uh, to those terminals that were shown. Uh, you can basically also add more than just the two wired zones, uh, but not directly to the panel. It's a little bit of a trick. Uh, so like other systems, if you have you know, wired zones from a pre-existing system, maybe you're upgrading to a wireless panel, uh, instead of changing all those zones and just spending you know, all that money that's not needed, you can get a wired to wireless transmitter. So in this case, for the Simon XT, uh, you can use the IQ Hardware 8 or the IQ Hardware 16. Basically what those are, those are the wired to wireless transmitters. You'll take wired sensors, wire them into that device, and then you can wirelessly program those sensors uh, as each individual zone to the XT itself. Now those do take up the zones that are allowed in the panel itself. So if you're using the Hardware 8, that's 8 zones taken out of the 40. And if you're using the 16, that's 16 zones taken out of the 40 that you're using. Of course, only if you're using all of them within the, uh, the transmitter itself. But that's how you can add more than just two zones to this for wired. Uh, you're not technically wiring more things into it, but you're using wired sensors and then using a wireless transmitter to make them act as if they're wireless sensors themselves. Uh, we do have, <clears throat> excuse me, we do have more information about the uh, Simon XT about wiring the panel, about programming sensors to the actual system itself, as well as information about the hardwired, uh, wireless to wired, wired to wireless transmitters that I mentioned as well. Uh, if you do have questions about those, about the Simon, about monitoring, about programming or anything like that, feel free to send us an email. Our email is support at alarmgrid.com. We do have a good amount of uh, FAQs as well. So check out our FAQs on our website, www.alarmgrid.com. Uh, if you did like this video, please like and subscribe and hit the bell icon to support the channel. Uh, basically, you guys get notified on whenever we release more videos. And feel free to give us a call as well, 888-818-7728. Uh, we're always here. Well, we're here Monday through Friday, 9 to 9 Eastern, but we'll be happy to answer any questions that you do have. My name is Dylan from Alarm Grid. Thank you for watching.